snow, rain, and colder weather on the way. Thank you for tuning in to Newslink Indiana. I'm weather forecaster Lexi Esterly, and tonight we're sitting at temperatures around 36 degrees, but we have a strong wind coming in from the west at 9 miles per hour that's making it feel a lot colder. It feels like 29 degrees out there. And if we take a look at our viewing region, we can see that most of the counties are in the mid to upper 30s tonight, but because of that wind chill, it's feeling a lot colder across the entire state of Indiana. Here in Muncie, it's feeling like 29 degrees in Terre Haute, 33 up in Fort Wayne, 26 degrees. So just generally a lot chillier across the state today. But if we take a look at tonight, it's going to dip down below freezing at 31 degrees. It's looking to be incredibly overcast and that strong wind will keep it feeling pretty cool tonight. Also for tonight, we have a winter weather advisory issued for all of the counties in our viewing region, which means that there is some sleet, snow and rain on the way that could potentially be hazardous. And if we take a look at tomorrow's forecast, we'll start to break that down. As you can see at 8 a.m., we're looking at temperatures around 29 degrees. It'll heat up by noon, but a stronger wind means it may feel a bit nippy still. But as we look at about 5 p.m., we'll see that snow start to come in. Heavy snow for tomorrow as the temperatures dip below freezing. And if we take a look at the precision cast, we can start to time out when we expect that snow to come in. And the snowfall for tomorrow, in northern counties, we're looking at about three to five inches total snowfall. In southern counties, one to three inches down in Henry or Wayne. But that snowfall could vary greatly depending on temperatures throughout the day. So it's important to stay tuned and keep watching us to make sure that you know how the snowfall is going to play out. And if we take a look at the precision cast, you can see that on Wednesday in the mid afternoon, that snow will start to enter our viewing region. As you can see, those northern regions getting more of the snow, whereas the southern counties will receive more rain and sleet by early on Thursday that will turn into mostly rain late Wednesday early Thursday and if we take a look at the precision cast for the entire state we can see how long that system is going to stay with us as you can see here going into Wednesday once again that snow and sleet and rain across the entire state of Indiana that will slowly phase out going into Thursday we may see a few remaining snow showers here in the southern part of our viewing region but really we should have a relatively clear clear weekend. There's a chance for a few scattered showers late on Saturday, early on Sunday, but overall pretty clear until next Tuesday when we're going to start to see heavy rains entering the entire state of Indiana, as you can see here. But before next Tuesday, we have our Valentine's Day forecast. We're looking at highs of 14 degrees for February 14th. It's going to be an incredibly cold Valentine's Day. So if you have any plans for that day, maybe stay inside. If we take a look at our seven day forecast, you can see that will actually be the coldest day of the week. We're seeing that snow that we talked about on Wednesday and Thursday transitioning to cold temperatures on Friday that will quickly heat up, leaving us with an above average weekend. And as we go into next week, we'll see that warming trend continue with highs of 49 on Monday and 48 on Tuesday, bringing back that heavy rain. And if you want more updates, be sure to follow us at Newslink Indiana Weather on Twitter.